Good midnight, this is Chi Level 7, and this is Pokemon Heart Gold Nuzlocke Challenge. In the last episode, we explored a little bit in the town, including the Yurkutik Dance Theater and the Burn Tower, and defeated the rival, and lost the Wooper called Muddy in the process. Two death total. So in this episode, we're going to challenge the gym leader and maybe do a little bit of something else after that, provided the battle doesn't last too long. Alright, so a brief look at my team, and it's probably a drastic change too. My Spinarak evolved at level 22, becomes an Ariados with uh, some ghost type moves. Next one is Joa with pretty much the same as last episode. And we also got our newly captured Sudowoodo named Brock. Totally at 25, trying to be the highest level of my starter. A Flaffy at 22, and a Zoop, what used to be Zubat is now Crobat. It evolved at level 22 into a Golbat, and then evolved next level to level 23 because its friendship level is pretty high, like 255 friendship points, so it just evolved instantly. I think that's probably the lowest level you can get a Crobat with. I probably think you can only see a level 23 Crobat and no less. So yeah, it evolves probably the earliest level in the entire Pokemon series. Unless I am wrong. Unless some people had like a level 10 Crobat, I'll be surprised. Anyways, so we're gonna challenge the gym leaders and we're gonna fight through several trainers who blocks the path and if you try to go away from the edge, you will fall down and you get sent from the beginning. Alright, so... Oh wow, she has five Pokemon. Oh, and this is a ghost type gym too, so I have a couple attacks that can um, hit the ghost type Pokemon for super effective, such as Shadow Snake and Bite. Oh, and Shadow Snake for Aria Dose, is, uh, it has priority, which is pretty good too. It hits a um, ghost type priority, can hit uh, Psychic and Ghost type super effectively. So yeah, it's in, it's, I think it's okay to use it competitively as well. I mean, Shadow Snake can be used on different tiers, like um, let's say for example the Uber tier, there's the Garatina forms. And then, I don't know, I haven't researched it lately. Alright, so she's gonna send out her third Ghastly, but anyways. So I haven't been doing much activity on Pokemon X and Y. I was thinking of going to play Battle Spot and upload it in YouTube. And we're gonna have some surprises there. Maybe I can do a theme team or something. I don't know, but I don't know, but it's that remains to be seen since I have other stuff to do. Have classes, finals. Um, the spring um, quarter starts right after one week of break, so like March 22nd to April 1st. That was like a very short break time I ever had. Okay, so it wants to learn Fairy Swipes, but unfortunately it's a multi-hit move. And assuming the Pokemon has a like a effect spore or poison point, it's more prone to getting poison. <clears throat> so, which is never a good thing. Or paralysis. Okay, so this is her fourth Scastly. Her fourth one. Let's see, what other ghost types are in Gen 2? We got the Ghastly line. We got the Mistrevis. And what else? I think there's only two ghost types in Gen 2. But then they don't... I mean, there, there are others. Oh shoot, are you blocking me? What? We use ghost type Pokemon. No normal type attack can harm them. Yeah, but your ghost type moves can't harm me as well. Ghost type moves can't even hurt normal types as well, so it's a stalemate. And you have the evolved form. 
I think in Generation 1, there was like a lack of ghost type Pokemon, and it's just Gengar itself. Mm. Type redundancy. Same can be said for dragons. You only see Dragonite, but it doesn't have a dragon stab back in Gen 1. It can't even learn fly because of the. I don't know. I mean, it has wings. Why can't it fly? <laughs> And Charizard is almost the same case. It can't even learn fly back in red and blue, but it's fixed in yellow. So it gets a flying type stab. And Sticky levels up once again. It's about to reach the Aces level though. I better switch to a different one like Radicate or something. What? What's going on? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see. That's why you want to see me that far. Well, as long as, as long as I know exactly where I'm heading, I'm good. And you have another hunter. And yeah, my shadow snake's gonna be up all day. Oh, sh sucker punch. Okay, you're starting to be viable. Oh, that didn't do much, though. Your defenses are super frail. Oh, never mind. Of course, you, you're going to use a critical hit, critical hit just to fuck me over. Game, you can't just mess me up anymore. I'm too good for you. Wins and losses, I experience both. So does everyone else. And... Okay. Yes! Oh no, I have to walk the long way around. I shall win. Okay, how many do you have? You have three and it's another Ghastly. Yeah, you know, those trainers are very good for giving you special attack effort values, but... In competitive... I mean, if you're playing just for fun, you probably wouldn't care, but... It'll be very sad to see you invest special attack on a um, special attack hindering nature, because... I seen one time where you couldn't even get one stat points even with 12 effort values invested and I felt it was a I felt it was a wasted potential unfortunately. <clears throat> and Hunter's almost down. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're going to curse me. You're going to put a damage on me. But it's too late because you have no Pokémon available. And Sticky's level 25. It's on the Aces level. Good job! Wow, it's attack went up a lot. Um, okay. Oh no, you do have another Pokemon available. Ouch, that kind of hurts. Um, okay. Got a Ghastly, and should it be able to, should be able to take you out with the Shadow Sneak, unless you have Sucker Punch. No. Oh. So this one's down. I think it's gonna be a real dose sweep, considering that they only have Gastly's and Gengars. I mean, Gastly's and Haunters. And we finally made it. So let's gonna do some quick healing. Let's see. Yep, super potion. There we go. Starting to use items. All right, let's begin. It's good of you to have come. Here in your critique, Pokemon have long been revered. It is said that a rainbow-hued Pokemon will come down to appear before a truly powerful trainer. You mean Ho-Oh? What happens if I'm playing Soul Silver? Are you gonna say like a bright white winged Pokemon will come from the Whirlpool? Um, I believe that tale, so I have secretly trained here all my life. As a result, I can now see what others cannot. I see a shadow of the person who will make the Pokemon appear. I believe that person is me. You're gonna help me reach that level. Um, I think Suicune chose me, so... And I've been chosen too, so I'm not helping you reach reaching that level. And you have another Ghastly. Up level. <clears throat> okay, so let's start with a Shadow Sneak, and just like before, as it takes out all the other Ghastlies, there, it's gonna take out that one as well. Yes, it does. Not bad. 
Alright, let's give somebody else a chance. Um, let's see, we got... Let me check his attack stats. He got 67, but Redicate has 47. Hmm, okay. And we need Joel to get some experience as well. Ariodos is just getting three levels more. Okay, let's start out with a bite attack. How much will it do? And oh, that almost took it down. And you flinch. Luck hacks, and you didn't heal for some reason. Okay, so we're gonna get some nice experience. Yeah, so who said Radicate was useless? He, he's good at the beginning. And it starts to deteriorate, but not at this moment. Oh, okay, this is your ace now. Let me check, let me check my speed. Um, okay, so 62, 36, 18, 33, 32, 78. Okay, so Crobat is the fastest one. Joel's the second fastest. But Gengar has base 110 speed, so he might have... Let's see, 115, 60, um, 60 is minimum, but with maximum IVs, it might have 67, which outspeeds, which outspeeds my Redicate. 67, 62, yeah, it's gonna outspeed my Redicate. If, provided they have 31 IVs, I don't know, uh, we just have to keep trying. Oh, now you're fast, and you prevented me from escaping. What do you think you're trying to do? Gonna trap me? But you are frail. Oh no, you... I didn't do half damage yet. Oh my goodness. And bites my only super effective moves. All my other moves does no damage. Oh, and you got the hypnosis. Ouch. That, that, really, that really is bad. You, you managed to hit me even with this 60 hit rate. Sucker Punch? Okay. And I'm still asleep. And you go for another Sucker Punch again. Okay, good. Okay, Gengar, you're almost taken down. And you missed. No, not missed, but just fell short. Fell short from healing. And the Shell Bell's kicking in. And you missed! Get get out of there, Gengar! Your hypnosis attempt failed, and I don't I don't think a critical hit's necessary, but still, Gengar is almost a threat. Had it had Dream Meter, you would have got your health back, but nope. And your last one's a Haunter, and you didn't even use a Hyper Potion yet. No, it's not over yet. I still believe we can do it. I don't think so. You see. I'm having super effective attacks, and you have nothing back in return. How sad could that be? And you want to trap me once again. You trapped me twice. We got more discipline than anyone else. Okay, there goes your hyper potion. Although you could have had us set a curse damage. That would have deterred me from attacking and have to keep healing. Give me a critical hit. Nope. Yeah, so unfortunately, those ghost types can't do much to me. And this gym is all about having ghastly hunters and Gengars. Maybe during the rematch, you'll probably have an upgraded team. I'll be looking forward to seeing that, but until then, oh my goodness, Rival Green, Rival Blue was correct. All, every single gym leader is pathetic. Oh, he wants to learn Crunch, good. Uh, let's get rid of, wait, but do I want to keep the flinch chance? But I got Headbutt to cover it, so yeah, get rid of Crunch. I mean, not get rid of Crunch, get rid of Bite. Yeah. And we defeated Morty. So that wasn't a bad badge here. That wasn't a bad battle there. We could have. Well, I don't think anything terrible would happen besides hypnosis and mean look. 
I don't think our potentials are so different, but you seem to have something more than that. So be it. This badge is yours. And we got the fog badge. Traded Pokemon can obey you up to level 50, and he'll give you a TM, and we can use Surf outside the battle, except that our um, Whooper's dead, but I could use it as a slave for now. And we got Shadow Ball, I believe. Yep, Shadow Ball. I'll probably use it on the evolutions. Alright, so we're gonna exit this gym. We are done with Yurkutik City. And what is, who is it? Oh. Okay. Hopefully you're gonna give me a choice scarf. Or a choice spec. Or a choice band. Or expert belt. Or muscle band. All of those amazing items there. Not those type resistant berries. Well, I better go find out right now. I better find out right now. Okay, what's the first one? A repel. Out of all things. Okay. You have another type resistant berries. Okay. What's the third one? Super potion? Okay. Not bad. It compensates for the one I just used. Oh, that's it. That's it. Wow, right at the moment. Alright, so we could travel this way to get a Red Gyarados, but I'll be severely underleveled because Red Gyarados is a level 30. But I did test it out a bit. You could go to that town without it being interrupted and you could get the 7th badge. Thereby um, bypassing the 5th and the 6th one. So you can skip. You can skip 2 gym leaders. Oh, and then I think this is where you can find an um, item finder. If I remember, is it is it you? Oh no, no, you don't have the you don't have the item finder. Um, okay. Is it, wait, it's a bird and a dragon. Okay, right, so maybe the item finder guy is right here because we need to search items. Oh yeah, treasure hunting. Yes. Okay. Yes. There we go, the dowsing machine. Uh. Oh, and also the dowsing machine is uh, in the trading card game. You can only have one. You can only have one dowsing machine in your entire deck. Alright, so we're going to register this. So yeah, we got two items registered now. One that we can press the white button and one that we have to tap on the bottom screen. But I'm not in the mood for searching items at the moment. So we did try to catch a Pokemon here, but instead we kept seeing Rotatoes and Radicate and none of the kind and the like. Among other things. What's this? A max potion. That's way too early. My Pokemon doesn't have my Pokemon don't have two um at least two hundred hit points yet. Alright, so let's put a Pokemon that needs experience though. Let's um let's put Ampy on the front. And you're blocking my way. <clears throat> I've been overseas, so I know all sorts of Pokemon. You know all 718, but if you're overseas you most likely see a okay. Shoot. <laughs> Although you're weak to electric, your ground type, um, your ground typing has made it completely immune. Oh shit! Okay, let's go to um, Bay Leaf. His magical leaf hits you six times as much damage. Mud bun, mud bomb. Okay, you can lower my accuracy, but my magical leaf never misses. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh yeah, it looks like I'm totally overleveled against other trainers, but in the gym leader, we're quite on par. Alright, so I guess I could encounter wild Pokemon easily by going in the grass. Okay, so, for, well, not the first one, but there has been a couple dupe clauses, like, like those. Like the Pokemon that you already have. We're leaving, and we better put Radicate in front so it can guarantee runaway. So yeah, let's do that. 
Okay, please, something different. Not those rotator lines that I have seen in um, about 10 rounds. And you came here again. Why? There should be something different like... Like Magnemite or Tauros or anything, but Rotata is just super common. Oh my goodness, I... Game. Game, give me something different. This is already bad as it is. Okay, come on. Give me something different. A Rotata again? Oh my god, I'm gonna have nothing by this route because every single time that I encounter it's something that are that I already have. Oh well, I'll just battle a few trainers. How many minutes passed? Twenty minutes? Uh, we were hoping I was hoping I would reach um what city? Ovaline City until this episode ends, but it looks like it's gonna take a while. Oh, that almost took it out. And... I don't know, does the static kick in? No. But you're gonna paralyze me anyways, so... Crap. Okay, so we're gonna take you out with a quick attack, and you have a... Oh, shoot, you have a Moo Moo Milk already. You got those um, pretty good items to heal. And I didn't do half yet. Couldn't use Thundershock. Actually, I could have stopped my video after I defeated Morty, but I shouldn't have done anything. I shouldn't have done something like multitasking because that's going to take out the that's going to take the duration of the video. Maybe after this battle, I'm going to end this. How much does it do? And it took it out. Wow, nice. And we got a nice level up there. Okay, so... After this battle... Okay, so that is it for today. I was supposed to stop earlier, but... The goal has been accomplished. We have defeated Morty, the gym leader. Got ourselves the fourth badge, which is... Halfway through the Pokemon League, but... In terms of game completion, it's probably 20%. Not much. Still have a long way to go. Right, but anyways, that is it for today. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.